Welcome back, everybody, to Prey, where we last left off. We were fighting our way through the, uh, the wastes of space. And we've just managed to uh, fight our way to the uh, trash compactor, apparently, or waste disposal unit. So that sounds fun. And we have been given the ample, respectable title of Death Walker, which I actually really like. Oh, hey, birdie. I forgot about you. Suck it down, bastard. Yeah, I was really hoping, actually, like, after playing this game, uh, when it first came out, because, like I said, I shotgunned this game in a day. Um, ooh. Oh, hey, guys. Fuck me. Well, we're fragged. Uh, I was really hoping, like, Tommy was going to be become, like, another Duke Nukem or something, because, you know, I miss those kind of uh, old-school characters that used to you know, crack out one-liners and actually have- oh, fucking hell, this is useless. Actually have a little bit of personality to them. I was never really a huge fan of characters that don't speak in games. Now, don't get me wrong. There, There is a, a place for that. I mean, Half-Life. Gordon Freeman never uttered a word and it, that didn't hurt Half-Life at all. Um, ooh, weird. Okay. Ugh. Oh, right, 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 right. Oh, yummy! Look at that sphincter! Bonsai! Ew, yum, yum. Oh, hey, buddy. You're upside down, bro. And through the wall as well, I might add. And you're doing gravity wrong, but let's not think about that too much. Yeah, I used to love um, those kind of characters, you know? Like Duke Nukem and uh, does anyone ever play Blood? Like one unit whole blood. Uh, at least the version that I have is called one unit whole blood. That game was amazing, man. So underrated. I did actually want to LP it at one point, but I'm not joking, guys. That game is hard. Like, yeah, a lot of people say games are hard these days, but no, Blood is actually hard. Like, really hard. Stupidly hard, even on, like, easier difficulties, but who knows, maybe one day. It's an old um, game, uses the same engine as Doom, um, with a stupid storyline, deliciously sexy weapons, and did you ask for gore? Ooh, because if you asked for gore, whoa, this place is coming apart. I like it. If you ask for gore, uh, blood's got you covered. Now, there was a second game called Blood 2 as well, but I never played that one. Whoa, fuck. Evening, fella. Alright, let's give you a juicy mouthful. Open wide. God, there's a lot here to swallow, guys. Don't spill a single drop. You're done. Who's next? Hey, birdie. Also, uh, just for shits and giggles, whilst I was sorting out the last recording, I did look up some footage of this on the PC. I found a, a woman streaming this. Uh, well, it is a past stream. Uh, she's actually quite entertaining. I can't remember her name. But it's actually unfortunate, because she was quite good. Um, ooh. But my god, on the PC, it looks shit ton better. I mean, yeah, go figure, right? But it really looks better on the PC. Like all of the objects and things that you can touch. Looks so much like cleaner and nicer, as you'd imagine. Which is kind of strange when you think about it, because th when this game uh, came out, the 360 was really new. Less than a year old, I believe. Um, for instance, Call of Duty 2, when that dropped on the 360, the 360 version was actually massively superior to the, um, the PC version. Because when the when the PlayStation 3 and the 360 dropped, they were extremely high-end machines. They were very, very capable pieces of machinery. Um, easily toe-to-toe -to -toe with a, a high-end game machine of the time. Whereas when the X... Well, especially the Xbox, 3, uh, the Xbox One. When that dropped, it was incredibly feeble, even by the standards of the time. 
and to a lesser extent the PlayStation 4 as well, which was faster, but just, yeah, this generation was, was very weak source. Possibly the weakest batch of consoles we've ever had. Now that's not to say they're bad. I've got a, ooh, hello. I've got a PlayStation 4 Pro, which I love, and uh, an Xbox One X as well, which uh, I love. So I'm not a PC gamer, I'm just stating facts. I'm not a fanboy of any any system. If I can play games on it, I'm going to play games on it. Oh, fuck. It's been many a year since I've cared what badge is on the plastic box that I'm playing games on. Oh, hello. I mean, I do kind of prefer the PlayStation, this generation. Because it has the better exclusives. But last generation, I was all over that 360. Ooh, whoa. He was fragged. Um... Yeah, play games, guys, not corporations. Nice. Although I've never really been a huge lover of Nintendo. I don't mind them. Ah, oh, you bastard. You took my health. I don't mind Nintendo. I've got a lot of love for things like Zelda. And I do like a cheeky bit of Mario. Shh, don't tell Luigi. But, uh, yeah. Not a huge fan. But oh, also, massive juicy news that gave me a proverbial... Proverbial? What even is that word? Um, proverbial... Metaphorical. There we go. That's the word I was looking for. Gave me a metaphorical nerd hard-on recently. A lot of you will know that I love the PlayStation Vita and the PSP. Ooh, hello. We're under fire here from what? What the fuck is shooting at us? Oh, we're getting pulled in. Not good. Oh, there you are, you sons of bitches. Can we destroy these? Yeah, I guess so. Come on. Ooh, fuck for that. I thought it was all over there for a minute. Yeah, a lot of you will know that I prefer my uh, Sony handhelds to my Nintendo handhelds. And I actually do like the Nintendo handhelds a lot. But in my honest opinion, the Sony handhelds literally kick the shit out of Nintendo's offerings. Nintendo arguably has the better games, kind of-ish. Um, but the PlayStation Vita is my favourite handheld of all time. It's an amazing piece of kit. Brutally, unfairly underrated. And uh, the recent news is Sony has filed a patent for a new handheld, which basically means I'm not going to be buying a Switch anytime soon. Because if I've got to make a decision between a Nintendo Switch and a new Sony handheld, I'm sorry, Nintendo can't even compete with that. Right, okay. So where are we going now? But I'm not going to say the, the Switch is a bad piece of machinery, because it ain't. It's a bloody gorgeous, gorgeous piece of machinery. And I would love one. I probably will get one. Ooh, here we go. It's just for Pokemon, if anything else, and Zelda. But I'm just not that into Nintendo games, to be honest. I don't like Smash Brothers. Ooh, hello. I'm not a huge fan of Mario Kart. I think Sonic Racing is better in almost every way. Um, Zelda's cool. I like Zelda. Uh, and Mario, the actual platform Mario games are good. And Star Fox used to be cool until the new one came out and it was garbage. But that's it. Metroid I don't like. I tried, guys, I've tried, okay, I've really tried to like Metroid, but, nah. Hello, my little fuck boy. Go for a little trip. Good night. Yeah, I just don't like the gameplay of Metroid at all. I don't like Sa anything about, like, Samus's armor or anything like that, it's just, it's just not my thing. Right, let's light you up. I'd rather have Master Chief. 
and his big sexy green sexiness. Come on. Alright, let's light you up with our water cannon. Nice. Lovely. Alright. Now, can we get some health from anywhere? Because we are really injured. Really injured. But, then as I've said, with Nintendo, you get Pokemon. And man, I love me some Pokemon. Like, really love me some Pokemon. Like, it's unhealthy. Seriously. So I guess we're going in there. Right, okay. What's down here then? Looks like big fat fuck all. Yeah, cool. But I guess I'm not going to lie. My favourite platform, obviously, is PC. Because, well, because it's PC, yo. Ooh. 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 Okay. I was not expecting that. I guess we've got to go shut this shit down. Yeah, if I had to choose one platform, it'd have to be PC. I don't even know why I'm rambling. Lack of concentration, yo. Focus! So, what do we have on this moon? Oh, hello. Would you like some fusion? Because I've got plenty of fusion. Apparently it's the power of the future. You tell me, buddy. These fusion rods do do the damage. Right, okay. Uh, no, no. Ah, moon physics again. Which I actually really like. I love how this game has moon physics and Destiny couldn't manage them. Are we really going to rag on Destiny again, Titan? Are we going to go there? Are we going to go there again? <sighs> Everyone knows Destiny's shit. You don't have to keep going on about it. There's got to be something else here. Surely. Surely. So what's on this? This is like the dark side of the moon. What secrets do you have for me? You're just another shield generator. Yeah. Alright. Oh, another shield generator here. Usually there's some kind of portal on these things. Portal to another world. Ooh. Is that going to turn the generator back on? Because we don't really want to do that. Unless turning that off. Ah, that was another switch. My bad, my bad. Ooh, fuck. Really? These rifles have some serious range on them. I'll give them that. Really? You're hiding behind a chunk of meat. At least my aim should be better than yours here. Nice. Oh, you bastard. Seriously? Really? Come on, buddy. That's not cool. Ooh. They've got, like, these little vector-controlled thrusters that killed us. Yeah, they're good at dodging when they want to be. They can dodge like slow-moving projectiles, which makes sense. Come on. Oh, man. Oh, my kingdom for a mouse and keyboard. There we go. Ooh, okay. Right, where have you gone, my little shit-headed friend? Ouch. There we go. Good night, sir. Come on. Come on. Yes! You're oh, bloody hell. Not another one of you guys. Seriously? You guys suck so much donkey duck. Donkey duck? Donkey dick. It's not even funny. Can you stop moving, please? Is that something you can do? Ah. <sighs> It's something a little bit more accurate. I'm sorry, did I say accurate? It's really hard to aim at these guys. Oh, what am I doing anyway? Why am I like flowing around as squishy little Tommy when I can be flying around as godlike Tommy? Come here, my friend. Let me grab you and do bad things to you. It will only hurt a lot. There we go. 
Okay, that actually was quite quick for him. Alright, let's get out of here. Hmm. Well, we're certainly travelling some distance, I'll tell you that much. Ooh. Multiple worlds. Well, we're being shot at. Oh, not more of you guys. Come on. Do you, like, not learn that you cannot defeat Tommy? Actually, that's a lie. You've defeated Tommy a few times. But Tommy always comes back. Ah, shit. We're injured. We're injured. It's all over. It's all over, folks. Here I say, talking about how godlike Tommy is. And Tommy is dead. But Tommy will return. Because Tommy always returns. Powered by the souls of his fallen enemies. Hey guys, remember me? Oh, nice. We started here too. Excellent. Have some acid. Plenty of acid for all you motherfuckers. Mmm, souls. Fresh souls. Well, I don't know where we're going from here. I guess we're going to the other planet. But we need... We need gravity. Tommy needs gravity badly. Can we, like, go the other way? No. No, I guess we can't. Can we fly to the other planet? Like, is there any point in us coming to this planet at all? I don't know. Let's find out. Boop. The hell was that? I think that was Talon. Oh. Hello. Some kind of plasma core. Are they, like, mining these planets for something? Or these asteroids, I should say. It seems logical. Ah, look. Ah, look, there's a switch. There is a switch on that planet. Come here, you little shit. Come here. You're fucked now, boy. Right. So we've got a switch on that planet, but... How do we change the gravity? Hey, pal. Hey, I've got, I got a fun place for you to go, buddy. Do you fancy some radiation? Oh, you dead. Never mind. <laughs> there, go get irradiated. Okay, so I'm guessing... Somehow... Yeah, because we have to land on that. Then get up there to push that switch. Yes, thanks, Talon. Um, okay, cool. Well, let's explore this planet a little bit more. It's planetoid. This asteroid, I should say. Asteroid, planetoid, it's all the same. Oh, this looks promising. Ah, this looks promising. Okay, cool. I'm just being a stupid ass. There we go. It's never as hard as you, you think it is. Just gotta stop overthinking the situation every damn time. Ah, oh, and I didn't make coffee. Ooh. Hello, guys. Don't worry. I'll get you momentarily. Ooh, good night. Ooh, I just sprayed acid all over your dick. I'm not even sorry about it, to be honest. Let's turn the lighter off. Oh, God, before we blister our hands up anymore. You now we're venting plasma. Okay, I see. There you go, buddy. Go clean yourself off. Evening. I mean, we've got the alternate fire with this, which fires that huge canister of acid. But I don't think there's any point in using it because it uses a hell of a lot of acid. For very little uh, extra damage output. Okay, cool. Right, let's go back. 
It's going to get our ship. And it looks like we've got to fly down there when the, ass, uh, when the plasma venting stops. Ooh, my. All right, Tommy. Time for another space adventure. We have extra radiation this time. Ah, oh, great. More friends. Hey, friendos. Plenty of acid for you. Don't you worry about that. Where's your mate? Hey, pal. Come here. There we go. Open wide. Yeah, I thought you'd like that. I got the cure to your problem. We're running out of acid again. Don't like running out of acid. That acid gun is my boy. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's ride. So that's where we need to go. Stop venting. There we go. Move! Um, shit. Okay. That was Sketch McSketch. Hmm. Ooh, this looks... Ghibli. Oh, shit. This is some kind of mass reactor. Alright. Ooh, okay. That's self-explanatory. I hope this is good. I hope this ship has some kind of radiation shielding. What the hell is shooting at us? Oh, those things are. Those things are some kind of strange gun turret dealios. Come on, let's recharge. Come on, recharge, please. Please. Oh, much better. It's like taking a leak. Everybody can appreciate what that feels like. Nice. I think this is probably going to do large quantities of damage to this ship. At least I hope so. Oh, no. Uh, Tommy, are we confident that we know what we're doing, buddy? Do we really want to get into that particle stream? Whatever the hell that is. I'm going to say we're probably going to have a bad time if we do. Can we destroy... Shit, we need health. We really need health. Where the fuck nuggets do we go now? Did we destroy that platform? That recharge station? No. We're just thousands of miles away from it. There is a difference. Okay, let's tank the damage. Ugh, charged. So I'm guessing... Oh, okay. Got more things to destroy. Of course. Uh, this looks bad. This looks really bad. This looks like it should feel tingly. I'm not in a good way. You know like when you've been sitting on your leg for an hour? And you stand up and it's tingly. It looks like it should feel like that in here. Oh boy. Oh shit, Tommy. You crazy bastard. Uh, we done broke it, guys. We broke it pretty hardcore. Interesting. You are actually becoming troublesome. Uh-huh. Ha <laughs> I love Tommy. Good. Alright, well that's one reactor I assume down. Repair that, bitch. Although she's probably got like millions of these. Redundancy, you know. Still, anything that we can do to cause her a little bit of discomfort is worth it. Uh. Uh. Are we like. Are we stuck? We have like a little flashlight on this thing. But it's very ineffective. Okay, cool. Boop. I must be getting Yeah, let's hope so, Tommy, because we don't know how long Jen's got. Oh! Okay. Seems like a... Well, we're almost on half an hour, so this seems like a good place to end it. Hmm. Resolutions. A crawler with one missing leg will attach itself to any target, organic or metal, and will only detonate when the proximity of an enemy. Or when shot. Ooh. 
Yeah, you never really get to use grenades that much. They just don't seem that useful, to be honest. It's kind of, you know, kind of a bit of a shame, really. Um, oh, we're only just on 25 minutes. Let's keep going. I don't want to stop playing, man. Ooh. Hey, mother. Fuck your threats! Do you really think you could have come this far on your own? I see the potential in you. That is why I have been bullshit. That is why I have been helping you. I said fuck off, keeper. Keeper? <laughs> How little you understand. Hmm. Really? Are we talking cash money or other? Hmm. So she's been helping us, really? I don't think so. I think. Ooh. I think the fact that we're immortal is probably helping us quite a lot. Although that would explain why they've been fairly light on the uh, the enemies. Ooh, more images of Jen. Really? I don't want anything from you. I'll find it myself. Hmm. Okay. Why do I get the feeling that she's going to fuck us over? I do like the story in this game as well. It's kind of, I don't know, it's just its just such a unique experience. And uh, it's a shame more people haven't played this one. Portal Hub Exchange. Well, that sounds good. We do like ourselves a Portal Hub Exchange. Oh, maybe not. Oh, shit. Yeah, there's a couple of portals here. Right. Uh -huh. Hmm. Well, okay then. Right, well, we appear to be stuck. Ah, we like to smash this. Oh! That one. I think we can do that. So I hope we can do that. Ah, what do you think of that, bitch? So it's quite interesting. She seems to know a lot. I wonder if she knows much about the after uh, life and all that kind of stuff. It's kind of interesting. And just who the hell, what is she, is the bigger question. Okay, I think we need to stand on that. We've got puzzles. I generally don't like puzzles in FPS games like this, but in this game they really work. Hmm. We are now on half an hour. So. Actually. Let's just see if we can. Yeah, there we go. Let's go fondle this button. Fiddle with this knob over here. Boop. And that puts us up here. Nice. Oh, we could use some ammo for this. Yum, yum, yum. Come to daddy. So it looks like we need to fiddle with some more buttons. Any more goodies, though? Looks like we're a little bit light on enemies around here as well, which is fine. We don't mind that so much. Alright, let's go sit on this platform. Oh, we can sit on that platform. Hang on. Does it matter? I don't know. 
Let's go flick the switch and see what happens. Oh, I guess it... Yeah, I guess it does matter. Yeah, we need to be on this one. Right, anyway guys, we're going to continue playing around with this puzzle. Puzzle? Puzzle in the next episode. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And when we come back, I guess we're going to continue proving our worth. Till then, guys. Thanks for watching.